Am I the a-hole for telling my boyfriend that he's going too far with our intimate life? I'm 19, and my 24-year-old boyfriend kicked me out of his house. He did it because I told him he was going too far with his preferences during our intimate moments. So, my boyfriend has always been one of the kinkiest guys I've gone out with. He likes all types of that funky stuff, you know what I mean. I on the other hand, love soft vanilla stuff, so we've always had sort of problems agreeing on a set of boundaries, and he has always kind of crossed them. He was always very sensitive on the topic, getting very defensive if I ever said that I was not into one of his kinks. So one night, we were doing the deed in our bed, and everything was just soft, nice stuff, when he just started grabbing my waist and increased the pace, becoming quite forceful, which started to cause discomfort. I told him to slow down, but he kept going faster and rougher. After I finished eating my pie, I asked him to be gentler, but he continued hard. It got so intense that my legs shook, and I started crying. I yelled at him to stop and tried to claw him off me until he finished eating the pie. He then pulled out and sat on our bed. I looked at him horrified, I started yelling at him, and he told me that it was a new kink he wanted to try out called apple pie torture for me. I've never heard of it and I did not like it. I told him he had gone way too far and he told me that if I didn't like it I could get out because it's his home and he does as he pleases. I started cussing him out and making fun of his kink things, and he got very upset by it and dragged me out of the house. I'm currently staying at my mother's house. He came over with flowers and apologized. I told him to leave and told him we are over. He threw the flowers on the doorstep and left without saying anything. I still haven't told my mom what happened, but I think I could have taken his trying out new things more nicely. Am I the a-hole? Here are the top comments. Not the a-hole. If someone has a kink that makes you uncomfortable and they force you into something you said no to, it's not right. It's important to prioritize consent and boundaries in any relationship. Exactly. I'm a kinkster. And nothing happens without full consent. The moment she said no, and stop, Things should have ended immediately. No one I know would even try anything new without discussing it beforehand. I firmly believe this dude should face some kind of consequences. Unfortunately, given the circumstances, the justice system probably wouldn't give her justice. I think it's bad that it doesn't seem like OP even realizes what he did was not just bad, but full-on crime. You don't forcefully bring new kinks into the bedroom without consent. He forced you. You are well within your right to report this to the police. Also, just because you have a house doesn't give you the right to do whatever you want to people in it. Get as far away from this piece of crap as possible. As a BDSM dominant, I am advising you to run. As an older person who has been in enough failed relationships to know better, I am advising you to run. I don't care what excuses or reasons you think you have for even being in this relationship. Get out, and then stick to vanilla guys so you don't have to compromise your needs.